I'm already past 22, so there's no way I'm getting my first job at 22. <laughs> and Namaliza should be 25, 26, so no way I'm marrying at 26. So. <laughs> I'm unlearning, so. Eric the Medic. Uh, hello guys, welcome to a new episode of Eric the Medic. And uh, today we're going to talk about uh, New Year resolutions. So, did you make your New Year resolutions? Did you? So, uh, I have a very interesting figure here that 81% of people who made New Year resolutions they fail by February. 81%. So uh, I was going to ask uh, those who didn't make the New Year resolutions, can we gather and laugh at those who made them? But no, no, we won't do that. For those who made them and it failed, uh, it's okay. Uh, let me start by saying uh, you're not perfect and you're not expected to be perfect. You're flawed, but above all that, uh, you're a beautiful human being who made an attempt at being better and I think that counts for something. Uh, so, uh, people, when people are making their New Year resolutions, mostly they want to exercise more, save more, read more. Those are basically most of the things that people want to change and I think it is attainable. Maybe uh, you might call me delusional but it is attainable. But if you, want to, if you want to be successful at making resolutions and following through on them, thing is, don't expect everything to just work out. You don't just blow bubble gum and turn into a superhero. You're, you're not Captain Man. You're, you're a normal human being. So accept the, this process. Trust the process. Like, let me show you a good example. Arsenal fans, we trusted the process. And where are we? I hope by the time you are watching this video, we're still at the top of the table. So yeah, so trust the process. Go slowly by slowly. Let me give you an example. Um, if you want to save, let's say you make a New Year resolution of saving fifty thousand, whatever currency, fifty thousand. Then you start. You stop at twenty thousand. Then you fail. By next year, if you decide to save. 50,000 again 20,000 is already attainable to you so it's like you're starting you're not starting at zero you're starting at 20,000 because you've done it before so the thing with resolutions make resolutions make crazy ones attempt to be better say I'll wake up at 4 tomorrow then you know what you will wake up at 5.36 but then when you start when you make the resolution again you'll not be starting at zero because on the road to success, there is, you know, there is like they put stairs, but what they don't tell you about the stairs is there is a portion of stairs that you're climbing, but doesn't look like progress, but you're still progressing, cause uh, life, some things you can only connect the dots from 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 after you you've gotten there, you're like oh, I woke up at five, now I can be able to wake up at four easily. I, I started saving 20,000, now I can save 50,000 easily, just like that. Because uh, the thing with life is that life unfolds slowly, there's no big break. Don't wait for that big break, because it's not coming. Life unfolds slowly by slowly, slowly by slowly. Today you wake up at 4, tomorrow you wake up at 4, to the other day you fail, you wake up at 6, you wake up at 10, but keep moving. If you wait for that big break, you will miss out on everything because life doesn't start at 40, it starts now, like you're living life now, don't wait to get to 40, don't wait to get that whatever to start living life because there's no it, it's right now, life is happening right now. Thank you guys, let me know your comments on that and will you make new year resolutions, will you make new month resolutions? 
let me know in the comment section thank you guys see you in the next episode eric the medic